A big day for opponents of the Dynamis Waste to Energy project. They filed a lawsuit in Ada County to stop the deal. And they got their first chance ever tonight to give public comment before a county agency. Yeah, it is only the Planning and Zoning Commission, but for them, it's a start. And given the results of Tuesday's election, the days of Commissioners Isaguire and Allman avoiding any public input on the Dynamis deal may soon be over. We're on your side tonight with the story. More than 100 opponents of Ada County's deal with Dynamis to create a waste to energy plant at the landfill were pretty worked up and ready to finally have a county agency, any agency, hear their concerns. I, I think that we're going into a uh, uh, unproven technology and we, we stand to lose a lot of money. Saving the environment from Dynamis and it's the way our elected officials, Sharon Ullman and Rick Isaguire, have conducted themselves forward without uh, any public input. They've refused to uh, answer questions or even to listen to some of our concerns. So it was a big deal when Planning and Zoning decided to hold this hearing on Dynamis, especially on the day that Idaho Citizens for a Clean Environment officially filed a lawsuit against the county in 4th District Court. The hope is to have a judge hear it before Thanksgiving and put a stop to all progress on the Dynamis project. I think it's pretty important that it, happen, it happens because um, uh, once Dynamis starts working on this, it's going to be much harder to stop them. Commissioner-elect Jim Tibbs was at this meeting. He and Commissioner Case opposed Dynamis, and he says the lawsuit is a good thing, possibly because it could remove the county from taking the lead on shutting Dynamis down in the new year. They may wait to see what happens um, rather than take some action that could expose the county to lawsuit. In the meantime, these protesters are just happy someone is finally listening to them as they turn up the pressure on the county. The Planning and Zoning Commission, by the way, cannot officially do anything to, event, uh, to affect the course of the Dynamis deal, but protesters are hoping that they can convince the commission to make some statement in opposition to the Dynamis plan. And we'll wait and see if that happens. Also, we'll see in the new year what happens with the new commissioners. Exactly. Thanks, Roland.